Welcome ladies and gentlemen to the fifth game of Be A Pro. It is the South Sea Sharks. 15 up against the DHL Western Province. And if we win this game, we will qualify for the playoffs. We are the defending champions. And for those of you who don't know me, I am the fly-off, Johan Labeskagni. And we've got a really tough game ahead. We've, beat, we've beaten the Lions and the Bulls. Pumas and lost to the Greek was so... An important game. Western Province lying second on the lock at the moment. The Lions well clear at the top of the table. So, yeah, important game here for the Sharks today. This could be where we qualify for the playoffs. If not, then next week will determine, or the next game will determine the outcome of our season. And we don't, really don't want that to be the, the scenario. We've stolen that ball on the ground. Now a chance here for the Sharks. Need to go to the blind side here. Change of direction. Now there's a chance here. Back inside they go. Great hands there. Now moving it along. But it's been picked up by the Western Province. Could be trouble here for the Sharks. They go wide. Oh, there's trouble here. Oh, I've managed to get him. So good defense there from the fly half. Surely they have to be into touch. Now they're going to touch. So it's going to be a line out on halfway. Our line outs haven't been that great so far this season. So something that we really need to look at if going forward into this competition. We are going to get this one. So now on the attack we go. I'm going to put a little kick ahead. That looks good. It's chased down. Oh, that's going to be a brilliant kick. Five meter line out to the Western Province. A defensive line out coming up and a chance for us uh, to maybe steal this ball. Let's see what happens. We've got it. We've got it now. Now we just need to control this. Passing brilliantly inside they go. Still going. Oh, so close. We'll go for the drop goal just to get the first points on the board. There we go. I'll take that. Three points to null. The Sharks over the Western Province. Can never be too sure that the try would have been scored. Now, let's go wide this time. Still going. Beautiful hands there. Can we control? No, we can't. And it's been turned over by Province now. But we've managed to get it back again. Let's see if we can go wide from here. Great little run. Oh, I've lost it. So Not that's going to be a handling error and a penalty against the Sharks for not releasing the ball. So a chance for Lilia Farno to get this penalty. And it looks like it's going to go straight through the middle. So free all it is. Right, the restart, well taken in there. Let's see what we can do with this. Big tackle there from myself. Need to have a big game. I've had a few very average games so far this season. Release. Good tackle there. Trying to force a turnover but not successful. Now the province is coming again. Just to maybe not Release. completely put myself in a defense mode all the time. But yeah, there they go. Run over me. So 
Province still very much in possession, calling the shots at the moment, but from inside their own half, which could be problematic for them. Still just spinning them inside their own half. Most important at this stage. Not for the tackles. Now we've turned this over and a chance now. Oh, we've lost it again. Or have we? No, we've got it back. And a chance here. Just a little dab kick over the top and beautifully collected by province but an equal good defense from the sharks it's keeping this the western province pinned in their own half own 22 will make it even better Release. just need to keep them pinned they're not they're not moment and how about this from Western Province, running it from their own line. Putting the pressure on us. Uh, still going is Western Province and now they get bundled into touch. So you guys did hear correctly there is a woman in the western province side it is a glitch at the moment in rugby challenge four hopefully they'll fix that some stage so the line out is good now we can have a run here good well done there's space here for the sharks Look from peterson but it's been snatched up by western province but they're going to touch so another attacking opportunity here for the Sharks. Looks like we've got our line out sorted out today. Yep, we've got it. And now another chance to attack. Here we go. This their space here. Yeah, this could be try time. No. Into touch they go. Five meters from the try line. Can we steal this line out again? This will be big. Yep, we've got it. Now, drive them, drive them, drive them. Not going to go for the drop goal this time round. Release. I could maybe potentially go for it now. Another drop goal and it's gone straight through. So six points to three. Two drop goals to my name and the Sharks in the lead. That's all that we need at this stage. With three minutes to go in this first half. Oh, Western Province have got it, but we've snatched it. What can, can we get possession back? No, we've lost it. And a chance now for Western Province. Just before half time. Not releasing. We've got the penalty and a chance to clear our own lines. Let's see with a minute to go. I think we should just call for half time here. Win possession from the line out and go to half time. I think that will be the safest road at the moment. The Hooter has gone for half time. Line out has been stolen by the West. Trouble here for the Sharks. Oh, they froze the dummy very neatly, and I completely fell for it there. <laughs> now, what can Province do from here? They're looking dangerous. Not releasing. But another penalty against Province. And uh, we we'll probably go for touch here and then work from there. Hopefully we can get our line out this time around. But unlike the first time when I said we were going to kick it out, we are going to try and go for the try here. First we need to win our line out. 
Each time it goes to Hyren Andrews, we tend to lose our ball, but this time he's got it. And the Sharks can go on the attack now. Let's see what we can conjure up from here. Can go to the blind side, surely. Back in sight we go. Here's space now for the Sharks. Oh no, that's not a good pass from myself there. But we still got possession and it's looking good. Now I've collected that beautifully and the Sharks still on the attack. What can we do from here? Another drop goal attempt. It is going to go straight through and it's nine points to three at half time. Well, game with the boot today so there you can see at half time Sharks got the territory Province got the possession tackles quite even and the line breaks as well three drop goals separating the Western Province and the, the Sharks at the moment penalty from Lilia Fana put them well on on roll here if the Sharks can score next it could be game over. Are oh, we going to win this back? I might have to go in there. And too late. We've lost it. Oh, they decide to go to the full back there. A little bit under pressure. But there's space here for Province to go the wrong side of the field. Province still going. Oh, look at them go. No, he's ran over me there. And the province still coming. We snatch that on the ground and he kicks it up. So not too much ground going there. Maybe we can steal another line out. Who knows? won a single line out just yet but now they've managed to get it and they're surely going to try and put the pressure on us now just not allow any space now there's too much space here and it could be the first try of the game western province over for it and suddenly that lead we had has been taken away if the conversion is solid which I think it will be province will be leading 10 points to 9 yes it goes over and one point difference here at the moment to now on us kick off well taken there and they come again looking dangerous now it's the province still going we've got it we snatched it beautifully oh not a good pass there but we still got possession all that matters at the moment why would you kick I did not press the kick but it's a clever little move could work out we've got them pinned in their own 22 now Oh, and another steal there. And we are going to have the line out inside the 22. Shall I go for another drop goal? That's the big question now. It was easy to go for it when there was no pressure on you. Now there's pressure on you. Let's see. We've got the ball. Let's go for it. Ah, oh, no, that's going to go <laughs> to the left. And, well, it's like I said, when there's no... It's easy to do it. It's when the pressure's on you. That you make the mistakes. Ah, got tackled by one of the women there. Release. Sharks are going to lose this. Somehow. And now there's trouble here.
maybe once or twice I should have gone for for the try instead of the drop goal but yeah it's been that close now the kick downfield my players way too tired to chase this down might as well just drop back the oh we've got them covered in their own 22 again but my player for some reason oh bad mistake from province there and now crouch now Mind. we've got another chance Set. big moments big moments what shall we do should go for the try yeah oh, there's a penalty coming up and now surely we're going to have a shot at goal here took the risk to try and go for the try and at least we got the penalty but not a captain decides we're gonna well big moments will that be the difference between winning and losing here today let's see what happens Find out so important we get this and we do get it so now the Sharks on the drive Sharks on the drive what can they do here oh just short of the try line let's go for it again do I have it yes I do and it's 12 points to 10 well it's become a drop goal fiasco here in Durban and now I'm just gonna bite my time and kick this downfield there we go nobody at home just gonna drop back in case they do decide to kick this as well but they get caught in around 22 fullback is not at the back and this could be trouble now just need to keep them out oh dear Western Province on the attack now need to try and keep them pinned now release good defense from the release. Sharks now if we can pull this one through it's going to be a great victory if we lose it it's going to be my fault because I went for too many drop goals surely should have gone for for the tries at some stages of the game but hey will be hero or zero that's that's what's going to happen here not releasing there's another penalty should go for goal from here let's see what happens oh no still not going for goal well the captain was doing some serious thinking here regarding not going for goal five minutes to go we've got that slender two-point lead well, we've lost the we've lost the line out just try and defend this as much as you can and into touch they go with three minutes to go nail-biting stuff here two minutes to go can we secure our own line out no yet again we've lost it and yet again we're in some serious trouble now just need to try and Release. keep them here in their own home. that's the most important now not give away a penalty we've got the ball and we've kicked it downfield but it's not out and a last chance now for the western province this could be interesting what they're going to do from here oh look at that pass that was a brilliant pass and suddenly western province oh goodness me 
Why did he pass? He had the world of sp world of space there, and only to beat me, and I was already tired. So they blew it there, basically. Just need to keep them out at the moment. But yeah, I can't see anything. This is coming down to the wire, guys. This is coming down to the wire. Oh, look at their passing. Goodness gracious. We've got it. We've got it. And that's the game, guys. The Sharks have managed to win this and put their place in the playoffs of the Curry Cup. The defense of the title still very much alive after another brutal encounter here. And we've managed to snatch this by 12 points to 10. 12 points coming from the boot of Lovis Gagny. Four drop goals. Try by Sinatla. Conversion and a penalty from Lilefana. And there you can see possession going province way. Territory Sharks. 66 tackles. Quite a big difference there. Eight tackles, four drop goals, three handling errors. But I must say, I think all of them went backwards or was a loose pass. So, yeah. Let's just see what the overall rating is here. I've lost quite a bit on my fitness and my speed and acceleration. My passing as well, catching and mental. So, that's not great. That's not great at all. A 3.3 3, uh, rating for me overall, which is pretty bad, considering I got four drop goals. But the Shark team, more interested in me, so well, the team won, and that's all that matters at the end of the day. Sure, I'll see you guys next time. We take on the Toyota Free State Cheaters. The Sharks basically already qualified now. It is going to be... The Cheetahs and I think the Bulls is going to play it out for the last spot. Let's just quickly have a look. And I can give you guys the full table. No, it is actually all to play for from the Cheetahs down to the Bulls. Any one of those teams can fill the last spot. And this is the schedule that's left. So, Bulls play Griquas and the Pumas play Western Province. So... Yeah, it's it's going to be quite tough, considering beat the cheaters. Any one of those bottom three can still make it. It's going to be interesting, but we will find out soon, guys. Until next time, this is the Rugby Guru. Cheers for now.